Cannon walk for Snowman's Land. Nice. It's not amazingly helpful, but it can be used to skip some stuff, so always appreciate it, I guess. Alright. Might as well grab help. Health, whatever. Alright, what is Dodongo? Dodongo is. Nope. For multiple reasons, nope. <laughs> the Shadow Temple having the, like, minigame music and Kakariko having the, like, Shadow Temple music is very funny to me. Classic comedy. I was about to say replace the bombs I just spent. Nope, I'm a fool. That's what you get when you expect anything. Turtle. Turtle, turtle. Uh. That was a power star. Nice. Alright, not worth picking anything else up, so just gonna leave it there for later. Down. I did not need those seeds. Oh, another thing about it, that is something I miss about Ship of Harkinian. I'll play Ship of Harkinian on my channel at some point because it is just a better experience of Ocarina of Time. But um, the fact that you could up the movement speed on you know climbable surfaces, it's so good. It's anyone who wants to play Ocarina of Time, I can definitely recommend that because it is just a better experience. Shadow Temple's on the way. Gross. Don't say that to me. Don't tell me I have to do the Shadow Temple. Gross. Nasty. Shut up. Yeah, well. There. What you got for me? One whole dollar? Nice! What you got for me? Now I'm trying to talk to you. Uh, Fire Temple protects Skin's Tower. Fire Trial, rather. Eh. Five old dollars? Yeah, no, I didn't. But it's money, so. Alright. Okay. Alright. Not worth it. Okay. 
Okay, archipelago item. Power star for Mario. Nice. Alright, and I'm out of here. Where do you want to take me? You were taking me to? Oh. Vanilla. Alright. It's random, so technically it can end up here. That's silly. Alright. Um, I don't need to head in there. It's just a recovery heart, which, yes, I could use. I don't care. Okay. Uh, garden... Well, not garden. Uh, graveyard stuff I can only do as a... Like, during the day kind of thing. Or night, rather. Man, talking is hard sometimes. Okay, were there any pots? There are no pots. Yeah, I don't want to fight the guys yet. Something about rolling under a giant, like, spider creature is kind of fun. It's just like, oh, you think you got me? Ha ha. And they're just like, what? <laughs> like, they absolutely could just, like, lay down and just crush you. But it's kind of cool. One whole dollar? I have to come here as a child, which means, you know, might as well do this. Okay. Third. Okay, that one doesn't work. <laughs> I need to be sure. Um, long jump for Mario. That's great. Long jump is so important. All right, bit of health. And I'm a fool. There went that health. Kakariko Village is on the way, the hero. Uh, I don't think I've gotten something there yet, so it's probably going to be in Dompe's grave. Let's be real, there is so many checks in there. Hurry up. Took it to the face. I am a man. Eh, gold school choice kind of important. Could not be important at all, but we'll see later. Here we go. Open that up. 
Suicide will be nice and neat. Uh, yeah, I'm never coming back here again. Ow. That was disrespectful. Unkind, truly. Nice! Entire heart container. Uh, there are pots in that room, but that would take way too many bomb chews, so now nah, I'm good. Um, double check there are no pots over here, and then I guess I'm heading back to Kokiri. Yeah. There's not a lot more to do in Kekarika right now. Main thing is, you know, the nighttime stuff, but I can't do that at the moment, obviously. <laughs> Let's go gambling! Hell yeah! Malin's obstacle course leads to a recovery heart. Well, yeah, I have that turned off, so. There's one thing I do know it's that Link's house cow is not a fun thing to go get. It's way too much effort for a single check. So I have that one turned off. I probably should have excluded the uh, 1500 Gerudo archery game, but I didn't, so. Mysterious item being $1, which I don't even get to keep because you handed it to me and then took my money. I'm almost always a full one. I'm doing good, Dima. I don't think I have any... Yeah, I have this. Alright, uh, thanks for right around here. How have you been doing yourself, Dima? Yeah, I ignored you. I mean, you just called me a hoe. What am I going to say? Yes, but I don't really plan on using them. I'm just doing a cross-randomizer between Ocarina of Time and Super Mario 64, so I figure if I'm ever stuck in one game, I'll just swap over to the other. When I'm doing a straight-up, like, Ocarina of Time randomizer, I typically do, like, you know, glitched waterfall and whatnot, but... Unless I'm doing, like, a speed run of it, I'm not going to be doing, like, bomb hovering or anything. I'm not even very good at it, to be fair. <laughs> uh, 
Listen, I don't remember you guys paying me, so... Despite what Apple thinks, I can't get paid for this. Oh, right. I haven't actually talked to Zelda, so I don't get the check for this. Oh, well. Bomb the well. Eh, it's fine. There's a lot of checks down there, so that makes sense. It's just gross. Yeah, I started up the stream today, and Apple Plus popped up telling me and everyone else in the stream that anyone who subscribes to me gets rewards on their channel, and I'm like, I'm not a affiliate or an a partner. <laughs> what? Ocarina of Time teaches a green rupee. Guess what I'm not doing? Yeah, I haven't streamed in absolutely forever. I'm just getting back into it, and... This is what they say? Oh, hey! You remember that thing you can't do yet? Haha! <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna check out the Deku Tree and then I'm gonna swap back to Mario 64. So what it is is, um, I just have two games up and I just swap between them, they send checks between them. I can do it with a crap ton of games, ranging from Mario 64, Offering of Time, completely forgot these were here so I just walked right into them, um, Risk of Rain 2, uh, Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga, a bunch of games. Rogue Legacy, etc, etc. And more games are being added all the time. If you ever want to try an Archipelago randomizer, I definitely recommend it. It's a lot of fun and it's not too hard to set up. It just takes a bit of learning at first and then it's just pretty much the same for everything past that. Alright. Eh, it's such a token. I don't know if they're important yet, so... Could be. I was playing Sonic Adventure 2. Crimson was playing Rogue Legacy. Kept getting bad runs and just running straight in and dying immediately so they could get a new child. And I'm like, dude, <laughs> you've murdered me like three times in the child garden. I, ju I just want to take care of my pet. <laughs> you died that fast by mistake? I assumed it was on purpose. Yeah, but have you tried getting good? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah! Okay, randomizer on the levels did work first one just happened to be fall on battlefield for funny I guess I think I can do everything here, but I can definitely give it a shot. I have faced the first hurdle. Right, I can wall jump, which means... Ooh, ooh, ah. 
Nope. Okay, I made it. Twenty whole dollars. At some point, I will be doing multiplayer randomizers. That will be a lot of fun. Well, that was one buck. All right. Mars 64 is an absolute treat, whether randomizing or even just doing vanilla. I definitely recommend the, uh, I guess, Vanilla Plus experience. I'm playing on Super Mario 64 EX, which allows for better camera control and things, and just makes it run a bit better. It's how I recommend it. It's, um, for Ocarina of Time, if you're doing a Vanilla Plus experience, Ship of Harkinian is fantastic. Not only 60 FPS and you can run up to 4K, but there's a lot of quality of life stuff that is just amazing. It also has a randomizer if you want to play it on there. So, besides just this, I'm going to be streaming games like Rune Factory Frontier, because of course I'm keeping up my Rune Factory stuff, getting back into that. Um, I'm going to be playing Omori, which Krim got me a while back, so that's going to be a lot of fun. I, mean, I think you can... I think it's possible to do it. You might need triple jump out. I know I've done that kind of thing before where I just kind of skipped the first star, but it might require more techniques than just wall kick. Because I don't have triple jump currently, I'm not going to be able to do everything, but, you know, eventually. Like a really good way to experience Mario 64 at this point is actually Super Mario 64 online. Playing that with friends is so much fun, and they have a lot of wacky game modes, like full Garry's Mod style craziness. It's a lot of fun. Um, is it this? No, nope. top, right, left. Yes, that's it. Stir. Bombs 5 has been sent. Probably should have long jumped that. Oh well. Gold Sculpture token. Eh. Could be useful. We don't know. That was bad. Alright. Let's try that again. There we go. 
Can't do a ground pound, which means I can't get those. Let's do Boo Fight 3. And I have long jump, which makes this doable. Not easy as my, you know, depth perception isn't amazing, but... Dang it. Also, you know... Not quite being able to see the best is... Eh, whatever. up so many times. Oh, well. Let's see if that really mattered. Normally, I just go into the basement and get the boost down there, but they haven't spawned on the first star. Yeah, if I had ground pound, if I could do the booze, either of those would get me what I need. I have a feeling like I'm going to be short, but let's see. You know what's really going to suck? If I'm one short. Because there's a eye right in here. Excuse me. Hello. Hello. Now I have to find one coin. If it was seriously one of the ones on the roof right there. I'm not afraid to cry on screen on stream. Yeah. Talking is way too hard sometimes. <laughs> Where would I find a single coin? Maybe the basement. Well, for the moment, I can try to do the attic stuff. Okay. Thanks, game. <laughs> As a reminder, I've played this game well above 100 times. I still can't claim to be good at it. <laughs> there we go. Deku nuts. Set my nut. Recu oh, recovery heart. I just heard. I just saw a recovery heart. I'm like, did I just fool myself? Nah, they don't have a V in its font for some reason. Alright, let's see if there's a single coin down here or not. If there's not, I'm gonna cry. There's no coins down here. This sucks. And they don't spawn. No fire, no boost. That sucks. That really sucks. Ah, there's not a single coin anywhere. I can't think of a single coin that I missed besides the one, you know, I messed up on and the ones I can't get. I got all the floating books. Yeah. Got all the red coins, so it's not going to be any of those.
all right, double check there wasn't a single coin under one of the coffins or whatever, and then I leave the level because that's unfortunate. Yeah, no. No. Okay. Sucks to suck, I guess.